Welcome back to Colonist Stream, my own series where I just fool around and build with mine colonies, and sometimes create. But what I have here is a couple more guard towers placed, so that now I have up to up to here claimed, which is perfect. So I'm going to put a university here, which will claim here, which will allow me to put a guard tower here, which will claim up to here. So I'll have up to here claimed, and that'll be nice. Uh, in terms of the university, uh, I'm not sure yet. I might just expand this wall up and over. I can't remember if I was going to do like right here and have like a thin alley or like go all the way. I think I'm just going to do the thin alley. Yeah, because that's all ocean. Yeah, I'll just do a thin alley. All the way up. And then I'll have this guard, guard tower available. Which will be nice. But, we're going to get right into it. And we're going to place the university right here. And then disappear for another long amount of time. <laughs> this is going to take forever to build, man. So let's go ahead. I have everything in my inventory that I'm probably going to need here soon. Like, I have, um, I've got a farm in my inventory. I've still got a couple guard towers. Um, got the university. I do also have, I have the barracks, but I need to build the university first. So without further ado, let's get this placed. And flip it around this way. There, that should be correct. Oh, wait, no, I need to be here. Yeah, that should be good. And then over here should be the same. Yeah, there we go. Now, so the reason why I'm doing this, right? Get two guard towers, get it into a nice little box. Once this gets up to level 2, it's still a little bit awkward there. But once it gets up to 3, it fits in perfectly. It fits in nicely. It's great. <laughs> it's amazing. And like, even right here, right? It's still a little bit wonky. But I believe once it gets to 4 and 5, it doesn't feel as wonky, right? And we'll put walls right here. It's gonna be it's gonna be nice. We're gonna I don't know what we're gonna put in the middle here. I uh, actually no, I think I'm gonna have the graveyard over there. Or the 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 the, the grave guy. Grave digger. Ne near the hospital. Maybe I'll put like a, a grave in between. Which will we'll, we'll be fine. But this is absolutely what I want. Like look at this. Look how beautiful this looks. Who wouldn't want to learn here? <laughs> Alright, so we're going to go put that back down to 1 to make sure that this is where we want it. And then we are far enough away that when we hit build options and we hit build building, it's going to say, hey, nope, don't have enough. Um, so I have to assign him manually. Also, just double check, I'm going to have to farm some birch. And oak, that's fine. This will be easy. Oh, the framed stuff. Okay. The rest of this is actually super simple. All right, cool. Santino, build building. And then... Um, yeah, let's go back to my... Base of operations and get what we're going to need for those framed blocks. Alright, so we're going to need this architect's cutter, which should be easy. Just need three logs, three stone slabs, and iron, which shouldn't be too difficult. Nice piece of iron, three logs. And I should have some smooth stones somewhere. Yeah, there we go. 
No, I didn't turn it all in. Oh, wait. Derp. There. Architect's cutter. Now, what this does is we can make any of these framed things. Now, it was framed cobblestone, was it? Oh, gosh. <laughs> I'm going to have to run all the way back. Uh, it was most likely the start of it. We can just go right here. Requ required resources. Lots of cobblestone. That's okay. And yeah. So it's framed cobblestone. Center cobblestone. Framing oak. Dark oak. And it's the up and down one. Cool, cool, cool. So now we can head back. Probably should have. No. Grab some cobble and some dark oak planks. Do I have some laying around? I don't. Pulp's fine. And now we put this in the center. No, like this. There we go. So center, frame. Uh, what happens if I... nothing? I don't know what this is for. So then we look for the plane. That is... yep, that's the only one. Grab this. We gotta make what, ten of them. And there we go. That is how you make these. I'm actually, I don't have a pick and I haven't charged this yet. Spent most of my energy getting this guy. Where is my pick? There it is. Let's put you over here for now. This is going to take a while. Alright, yeah, I'm going to place this back in the town hall. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to let that build. I'll be back. Ah, another morning, and look! It is snowing. You know, one of the things I like about the, the whole seasons things, now that we're not in an acacia biome like the last time I tried this, is the snow looks really nice. And, like, it looks like it's going to work really well with the fortress once I have this all built up. I mean, just look at this. Like, look at this. I mean, that's going to be taken down and there's going to be more stuff in the distance for, for the colony. But, like, ah, oh, there's just something so nice about this. God, I gotta get this filled in. But, anyways, I have the university built. I have more guard towers built. I'm slowly raising my militia of children but, to spread the walls and such. I think I've gotten... Yeah, up to here. I've got this one built. Which has expanded the boundaries. Uh, I'm hoping... See, I cut all this way. Because I thought maybe I could... Um... Maybe I'll put a barracks here, actually. That could be cool. Yeah, let's do a barracks there. So let's halt here for a moment. Do a barracks here, another guard tower. I'd have this be like, uh, like a, a secondary port, or, and then, yeah, I don't know, but I don't know what I'm doing with this port business. I'm not a builder, but like, just the idea, like, this is the tavern, the the port, the the tavern port, the big port where all supplies come in, you know, up here to the warehouse up here. Yeah, makes a little bit of sense, but we can we can get this going. Um. But anyways, we're not here for that. We're here to get Miss Michaela Goldwell. Uh, she should be the decent... 
university worker? I thought there was someone else. Anson? Anson would be better, actually. Leroy. <laughs> um, whoa, Preston. Whoa, Preston. You're an archer, which means you're using what? Agility? Stamina? Crescent's good. Uh, well, I th thought. I thought I was using Michaela, but now I'm second guessing it. Maybe, maybe I just make. Preston. Yeah, maybe I make, make Preston, the researcher. So that's just going to be a little bit easier for him. Work, work. And then, can I? Work, work. Yeah, I want to take your bow. And then I want you to immediately, not that one. Although the hospital is going to be imperative as well. Uh, combat. Oh, shoot. Right. I do need three blocks of iron, so I'm gonna need to get that real quick. Let me let me go get that real quick. Alright. We've got the blocks of iron. Let's get tactic training. Now this is going to take uh how long? 30 minutes. Alright. Well. I'm going to start placing some more of these. Probably actually put a guard tower right here, since... Oh. Wait. Wait, what? Extend it out that way. But it didn't extend out this way? Why is that? Wait, did I hit the, the limit? No, don't tell me I hit a limit. No, that's going to be a config change for sure. Hmm. I also need to figure out a house for him, because he's not going to be happy if he has to walk all the way over here. Although I'm curious about putting housing here-ish anyways. So maybe it won't be too bad? <laughs> we'll, we'll see. <laughs> we'll see. Uh, let's get over here. Um, head to sleep, maybe the snow will pass, and I'll start working on walls and figure out why that didn't expand. If I have to fi uh, fiddle with configs, I will, because I want this to be a big thing. Uh, do you not have a place to sleep? That's not going to do. Oh, you were assigned a place. Yes. Yes! Murder! Uh, that's... That's a child. Which means I need to put him in bed over here. Hey, 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 no dying. Did he run away? Eh, better than dying. I don't want, really want to replace anyone just yet. I've come too far to be replaced. <laughs> Alright, Preston. Eesh. I don't like that. Alright, let's actually recall him so he can go straight to bed. Uh, no. There we go. Is everyone tucked in? Everyone should be tucked in. Nice. Alright. We will come back uh, once the barracks are done.
That was embarrassing. <laughs> uh, what I was saying is, looks like the guard tower pushed it forward, so I don't have to mess with the configs yet. But, with the barracks unlocked, it just took a while, it kept snowing. But I did unlock it. Um, we can get it over here. Oh, that means my... I had a new one to put up, but I'm going to have to take these down for the time being. <laughs> All right. Wait, why are they not stacking? That's weird. What? Hmm. I wonder if it was, uh... Yeah, probably. That's a shame. Alright, so let's get this barracks placed. We got military... Uh, barracks alternative 2, I'm assuming is uh, the long one. Excellent. So we want this to be twisted. Perfect. And pushed back. Oh, actually. Did I get it perfectly there? Oh my gosh, I did. This is gonna turn big here in a second. Yep. Okay, push forward, dig it down. Surprised it hasn't... Oh, Ernesto grew up. Good. I lost like three... Oh! There we go. I lost like three guards in the passing nights. Alright, so yeah, it comes all the way up to here. Oh my gosh, look at that. And let's bump this up to five real quick. Yes! Come on. This is... Oh. This is why we chose the fortress. There's been a few updates since, actually. But, yeah, no, that looks... That looks cool. Let me get a higher vantage point. Yeah. Yeah, once we get more of these buildings. That's gonna look so sick. Even just at one, right? Alright, let's go get that built up. And I'll be back as soon as it's done. Second time now. <laughs> uh, I was just saying, we lost Raven to pillagers. Groups of four. I really need some some armor, but gonna need the cow herder's hut. Maybe that's that's what I do next. But I'll need more homes first. I'm going but Ernesto. To work for you. You are now Lord Commander. You may be the youngest guard amongst the lot. But I'm sure you'll step up. Okay, okay. Uh, yeah, high five. <laughs> well, he's a man of his work. And now, over here, I have another barracks being built. Um, this one I'm planning on getting uh in that little like four areas mentioning over here it's not going to be a gate unfortunately but it'll still be fairly opposing and whatnot it'll be good probably just like a shipyard out here that you can get to from like a little little dockway right here maybe that's what i'll do 
Um, so yeah, I'll probably put a gate right here. That could make sense. Um, he's walking back. I did increase my simulation and my render distance just so that things can be seen. He's running back, which means it's probably nighttime. Which reminds me, I should probably get research going. So let's go ahead and skip the night. I'm going to grab a couple things I think I'll need. And we'll come back over there. Alright, and here we are back. Didn't forget to unmute myself this time. Oh, hey. Nice. Uh, so what we want for sure right away is we'll want the hospital. So let's get that going. Uh, in terms of level 1 research, though... Uh, Keen would be nice. It unlocks the library. Don't know if we want that just yet. Um, although it does need three houses, which we have. Okay. Uh, oh, hey. Good job, dude. Uh, first aid. Citizen HP plus two. I uh, could do that. That could make them a little bit more hardy, which I think also helps the guards. Which would be good. Higher learning unlocks the school. I'm pretty sure that allows us to train kids, get their, um, that before they become adults. That could be good. Ambition, Work mystical sight, I will need that for the graveyard first, which means I'll probably want to get this first. And after I'm done with this little Work area. Work. So let's see, combat. So I think... HP I don't want to do just yet. I don't know if I want to do... This one would be nice just because I kind of need them to stop sleeping so much. Maybe I'll do that next just to get that going. Field use I don't want to do until I get the blacksmith. Guard armor plus 10% durability. That could be good once we get... The leather worker, or whoever does leather armor. Taunt could be good. Wait, what? Oh, I need taunt to get the... I'll need the Fletcher for that. Hmm. There's some two. Nice. Dude, you are leveling up like crazy, man. Uh, technology, though, this is the the bit that we are really going to want. Like, composter uh, huts for with that. Uh, compost. Um, soft shoes would be absolutely fantastic. We will want to get that as quickly as possible. Uh, the enchant... I don't think we need that, but we will to get the nether miner, so maybe I will need to do it. Alchemist... Adds expedition log. Oh. Maybe I rush this when when I can. Spart. Fishers can find treasure outside the ocean. Interesting. Uh, stone cake, though. This is the one I'm going to definitely need, but it needs minor level total three. Crushes that would be nice. The sawmill I will definitely need as well. Gets the Fletcher's hut, Sifter's hut, and yeah, smeltery, block break, glass blower, stone smeltery, stone smeltery I'll definitely need as well. Blacksmith. Um. That would be amazing. Hmm. Maybe... See, I, I need three total mines and forester huts. Okay. And then I'm going to have to get some planning going, huh? That's still going to go. Okay, so let's go ahead and let him finish that up. Um, hmm. Allow me to figure out how I want to do more of this mining stuff. So I'm pretty sure I could probably... 
get a couple more foresters somewhere around here and have like a uh like this guy's a good starting one. I should have had him be chopping these down. Uh but for aesthetic sake of like this is the starting area, I think it's fine. I mean I know I can move it, but I like the aesthetic. Probably get a forester area somewhere around here. Probably have it like be like a like a woodworking where there's like people doing chopping down trees, the sawmill, all the woodwork. Definitely gonna need to expand out this way very soon. As the snow falls upon this night, I must also end the video a little sooner, as you know, I usually want to, but it is a, a bit of a shorter and like nicer series, you know? Just chill. Like the air. Uh, but my plan, I'm gonna get a farm and the cow herders. I'm gonna let this finish up. I'm going to, in this area, get another farmer, four residences, and kind of fill in a little um, area with like farming related things like composter, apiary, flowers, hut. Um, I don't know if it'll all fit here, but I'll get some of them over here. And then uh, I'll, I'll plan it out. I'll plan this out and it'll be next episode that they are being built. Between now and then, I'm going to get walls set up, get this finished up, get some more walls, get these guard towers so I can expand out with the word. And I think before I start this, I'm going to put a warehouse and a courier up here. So that, that way, once this is ready to go, all this is ready to go, farmers and whatnot, uh, I'm going to start with carrots and potatoes first until I get one of these to level 2. Then I can do wheat and start breeding up my sheep and cows. And then the couriers will move things around. So it should be good. I'm going to get... I, I have an idea for the couriers and the warehouse. It's going to be nice. It's going to be similar to this down here. A lot of stuff is going to be similar down here, but I am hoping... That's weird. I'm hoping that I can try to make it look nice. In the meantime, definitely going to be clearing all this out with the destruction stuff. And while things are being built, I'm going to go ahead upgrade our power uh, to a little bit better. We're going to get our farming stuff going to the point where we can get proper seeds. And we can start growing some stuff. Starting with the most terrifying part. Farming blazes. So that we can farm blazes without getting hurt. Yay. But until then, thank you guys for watching. And I will see you guys next time.